John Hartman here from my LaFontaine studio to talk to you today about the writing of George Bowring. George a British Columbia based writer uh, who's had a long and distinguished writing career, over 120 books published, uh, books of poetry, um, fiction, nonfiction, plays, chapbooks. In fact, he's one of only, I think there's four different uh, Canadian writers who have won the Governor General's Award in two categories, and George has won it in poetry and in fiction. Um, when I first uh, approached George about uh, painting his portrait and said, uh, is, is there a book I could read of yours that would tell me about the place that's most important to you that I'll put in the background of your painting? And he said, well, that's very easy because in 2015, I published this book, Writing the Okanagan, and this book uh, brings together uh, writings from George's entire career, all of which deal with the fictional town of Lawrence, which is the real town of Oliver, which is where George grew up. So it's in the South Okanagan, which for many, many years was uh, primarily a fruit producing region. And um, uh, in the course of talking to George, about the Okanagan, about Oliver, uh, it was clear to me that he was um, uh, nostalgic, I guess you could say, for lack of a better word, about the um, uh, change uh, in the Okanagan from, as orchards, fruit orchards are gradually replaced by vineyards and by wineries. And uh, there's a poem of his, which is the one thing that stands out for me from in, in this book of his, and it talks about how when he was growing up, the Okanagan, the lake, which is a widening of the Okanagan River at Oliver, uh, that they didn't think of what was around them as nature. Uh, they just thought of it as the place where they lived, worked, and played. And they didn't, in fact, see themselves as separate from nature. So if I can read this poem, which I'd love to do, it's called, I Watch My Father. I watched my father take a bar of white soap into the lake, knew I was learning another way of my people. We wash in the place where we play. We work there too. We don't call it nature. It's only what is afforded us. We take a bath and what is granted and give back what we can. The work of George. George Oliver, George Bowery, writing about Oliver, B.C., fictionalized as Lawrence, British Columbia.